Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas. I'm your host, and I'm here with TNT Dynamite, the explosive one jump shooting man on the I sticks. have one stick, and it's in my hand. And we're playing Mad 19, pretty young thing. <laughs> we. I want to be with you. <laughs> We're playing that Mad 19 relocated franchise with the Toronto Mounties. You damn skippy. As always, playing offense only. Simming that dizzle. The dizzle is simmed, and we're using that balanced playbook. Edward Timberlake, Justin's brother, is our coach. <laughs> Are you name, name off all our players. Fuck it. <laughs> I do that when I do the Browns videos. I give a little synopsis of like all the fucking drama going on, like, man. Like every episode, kinda. You, sometimes you talk about Edward. What's her Edward Timberlake battling uh, his food addiction? <laughs> wow, know, look, look, Jonas. Look, all right. Look, You're I didn't fine. want it to get real. You're gonna fat shame our coach. <laughs> First thing, there's the hooker of our team prostituting himself out. We see him. Every it's not time. just a clever name. We see him every time. Why is it always like the same five guys? Because they're comparing the best player at each position. Welcome and in, his everybody. position Take is missionary. And you're <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> it's my position. His is froggy style. <laughs> what does that consist of? Um, looking like a frog. <laughs> that Why you coit? <laughs> Why you coit? How do you look like a frog? Like, like the frog on its back or a frog <laughs> on its front? Whatever you want. And you just like hop and flop down. Or? Yeah, you hop and flop. I guess that's hop the and flop. Yes, the old hop and it's flop. It's the hop and flop position, I guess. Yeah, yeah. I used to um, do no, man, we got Logan Hillenmeyer. He's our fucking quarterback of the future. He's a rookie. He came out of the draft as a star. Yeah, I'm, I don't know. I'm kind of liking Hy Hyman Widener. <laughs> He's pretty Logan good. Hyman Widener, and uh, we got the Whoa. Barkley, the Barkley Center. Oh my God. He's dead. Yeah, he jumped on top of you. <laughs> he uh, he was like that genuine song. I believe that's called glomping. <laughs> what? Glomping? What the fuck is glomping? Sorry, that's this weird anime shit, brother. Oh, shit. Oh, I don't want you to get too deep. I mean, you can throw it <laughs> you out. You already know too much. Maybe some of our fans will be interested in it. Into what glomping is? Yeah, maybe. I don't that's know. When you oh, God, Blocky McBlockface. Oh, my God. He dropped it. No wonder he's called Blocky McBlockface, because all he does is block. He's worthless otherwise. <laughs> Even as a person, a brother, a son, and a husband. Worthless. He's talking about his personal life. I see that. I'm the owner. I know these things. He came to me. He goes, he goes, Jonas, I know you own the team. I go, what's up, Blocky McBlockface? And he goes, dog, things ain't good. And I said, why are you a trash human? And he goes, because I just want to come, come on top of you. What? Jonas. <laughs> God damn. All right, look, look, look. That didn't look. Out like what I the fuck is wrong with you? I told you, what, like two days ago, <laughs> you need to be at like a 9.2. <laughs> no, like he was. He was <laughs> don't you just, no, no, you cannot watch, fucking watch take right it there. back. See, he's like coming on top of you Jonas, right there. Jonas, Jonas, listen. It, like dirty, dude. My dude. Dude, it wasn't my, dirty in my, my head at the time. My friend. <laughs> We're not just going to start. Turn it homoerotic. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Halfway <laughs> through. I did not mean that to sound as homoerotic as it was. Gee, we're still in the first quarter, man. Woo. We're never going to get monetized with you. Well, I can't help it that you're taking my words out of context. We were having a nice, innocent conversation about uh, bumping, and then you went and fucking got all off the rails. I'm telling you, he was keep Blocky McBlockface came to me and told me things. Oh, I'm gonna fucking light this dude up. No, you're not. Yes, you are. Oh, I lit him up, but he flipped on me. Yeah, he jumped at you. He jumped at me. What a piece of shit. Dude, why are we both wearing our uh, home uniforms? Did you notice that? Is that right? Am I right there? I don't know. Let me see. Because they're wearing their dark jerseys. And yeah, dude, why, why is that? Yeah, see? Yeah, dude. Maybe because our colors aren't conflicting, it doesn't matter. I cannot see anything. <laughs> You're like, oh, I don't even know what's on It does. It looks like a red blur across the bottom of the screen there. Not even going to lie. Oh, my God. He's shaking and baking, folks. Call him a pork chop. <laughs> what? <laughs> Call him a pork chop. Yeah, dude. That's what you put on shake and bake, right? I've never had shake and bake, actually. It's good, dude. Is I make it? homemade chicken tenders with shake and bake. Chicken headers? Yeah, chicken headers. No, dude. Homemade chicken tenders. Homemade chicken tendies. Yeah, dude. You bake them in the oven. They're fucking scrumptious. Why wouldn't you just say tendies? Oh, yeah, because I'm going to go with the, the three-year-old version of the word. That's right. 
Why? Why use lot of word when when small words do trick? <laughs> yeah, okay. Kevin. <laughs> funny. Nah, dude, you um, you take those chicken breast tenderloins and you put, tendies. Yes, I'm a and familiar. Then you, then you shake and bake them instead of uh, shake and bake pork, and then you put them in there and you bake them in the oven, and it's like fucking magnifique, dude. It's what like, is it like a fucking a shell of just like herbs and spices? It's like um, it's like breadcrumbs and seasonings and shit like that, and like oh damn. What the um, fuck? Breadcrumbs and seasoning? Yeah. And it just I'm encompasses the wetness. I'm not a pigeon, Jonas. I'm not what? a pigeon. Nah, dude. It cakes on. Like a crouton covering? It's like a shell. Is it like it's a, like a cr- breading. A shell? <laughs> you're, you're no, Jonas. I don't too. honestly know what a shake and bake is. I know it's fucking Ricky Bobby. That's all no, I know. No, dude. It's like, it's like, it's like breadcrumbs it's and seasonings and things okay. like that. You, and it, you shake it because the meat is wet. It attaches to the wet meat. It ain't the only meat in the room. That's a little... <laughs> All right, I'm sorry. <laughs> Come on, who's blue and lowbrow humor I know, now? right? Dude, I hey, look, that's my one. <laughs> that's, that's my one. You yeah. started talking about wet meat. What do you expect from me? All right, so you just, like, fucking put crouton Ooh, dust. Russell hustled right in. And then, no, then it's like... It's crouton dust. Essentially, I guess. <laughs> okay. If you want to put it in that term. And then you put it in the oven and you I bake do. it. And then it, like, it helps keep the moisture in. So you get these, like, nice, moistured tendies, as you call them. And you fucking... It's not me, man. That's that's America. It's, yes. I've never heard them called that in my entire life. So I guess I'm not American. Mm, no. Nah. Mm. Wow. Judging me because you're calling them a tendy. <laughs> I'm just saying, I guess that's man. how life works hey, Look, this is... We don't speak Latin, Jonas. This is an ever-changing... This language is in flux. Oh, is it? Yeah. I gotcha. It's I like challenge a- you to Google Tendies after we're done. And, and it'll come up on see. Urban Dictionary. Let's see. see what comes up. Tendies? Yeah. Someone in the audience, can you uh, can you put Tendies and tell me what a Tendy is, please? Somebody's in the audience right now. That's what I'm saying. I was speaking to the live studio audience. We're having a crazy town compound at the moment. We do have a live studio we audience. We actually do have a live studio no, audience. Don't mention any names, Jonas. No, we no, We don't want no. people There's going no to their names, house. Dude. We're not name dropping. This isn't. We're not oh, name God. Dropping. Oh, Jesus. Holy shit. He's no, going. His was, mother called. No. Watch. What? That was, a good, that was a good run. Yeah, it was. Fuck I don't know if name dropping these two names are going to get us any more clicks or anything. I am not name dropping any names. Oh, wait. Jonas, let's just tell him Kanye's here. Kanye's here. Kanye's here. Kanye uh, and Jay-Z. Elon Musk, he showed up. Yeah, he showed up, dude. He's like, flying to the moon, bitch. Yep, Jerry Seinfeld, he's in the house. Yeah, Ben Stiller. Hell yeah. Uh, Brian Urlacher. Kevin Spacey is not here. <laughs> but Just he- saying. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> Making sure he's not here. <laughs> Takashi Six Nine showed up for some no, reason. No, no, he's not. Why. He's not allowed to show up. He didn't get out of prison to come he hang out. He can't come. No, no, uh. I mean, he's allowed. He's having a little bit of problem right now. <laughs> Aren't we all? <laughs> Aren't we all having Aren't problems? Aren't we all? Yeah, I guess so. Ooh. Yeah, man. I was really shocked that uh, when Barack Obama showed up for a little bit, he was here. The Rock showed up. Yeah, the Dwayne Johnson showed up. He took took a busy moment out of his schedule of eating five thousand calories a minute. Him and Obama came in the same car. Yeah, they did. They, they showed, showed up. up together. Somehow they were both in a nineteen eighty six Yugo. Yeah, and they just showed up and they were like, "Hey, yeah. what up, dude? We're Mich- in our weekend Michelle Yugo. was in the trunk for some reason. Who was Michelle? Oh yeah, she was. I don't know why she'd be in a trunk, but yeah, she was hanging out, dude. Yeah, so these are all the people in attendance for our live studio audience. Yeah, the- yeah. Well, the, well, what happened is Dwayne the Rock Johnson called Shotgun, and the Yugo's really small, and they had uh, they had some luggage in the seat, so Michelle had to ride in the. Hatch. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, dude. She sense. wanted to be like a dinosaur egg and just open out the hatch. She wanted to hatch out How of the Yugo. The f- where do you come up with this? <laughs> what? Br- Britney Spears. <laughs> she was singing Toxic earlier for us. <laughs> yeah, she. She. Yeah. Uh, that my favorite Britney Spears song. Yeah, yeah. Because that, that's a Britney jam. Oh shit, dude. Did you just get a flag? I got to play a game. You I was so pay enthralled. You got attention. Dude. Keep your head in the game, dude, bro. There were so many celebrities in this house <laughs> that <laughs> I couldn't even. Whew, 
<laughs> I'm just saying, man. It's like I know when I think of Britney too, I lose track fucking of time. It happens. Dude, it fucking happens. Uh, Post Malone showed up. We had to kick him out. Yeah, he's gotta get the fuck out of <laughs> he here. He's fucking vaping too many clouds in the house, bro. We're vaping. like, bro, there's no vaping. No, Two yeah. at once. Did you see their legs? There was four broken legs. It might as well bet a mountain. Who's horse. the star boy after this, you? This fucking Who's Speedy McGinnis, fucking Usain Bolt plays for the Redskins. I Who guess. Who the fuck was the motherfucking star boy that was just <laughs> chasing you around? Oh, Star! I wonder if the Star Boys still exist in Ohio, dude. Do you remember them? The weekend? That, no, yeah, the I remember fucking, him. Uh, oh. There was like a motorcycle club around Akron, and they were like, they would like, they would literally drive down like the freeway and stand on their motorcycles and shit. That was interference, by the way. That is an extremely esoteric comment, Jonas. But no, I, I from Ohio, do not even know what the fuck you're talking you know about. Who they, they're, they're from the Akron area, dude, and they, they literally. They're like a motorcycle club. They're like, biker boys, we set our own rules. Like, they think they're cool and all this. Yeah. But, like, they literally, they used to, like, ride down the freeway and shit. And, like, oh, my God. Oh, my God. And they would, uh. <laughs> and they would, uh. Jonas just has orgasms mid-sentence. <laughs> I'm, I'm keeping it real. With this I'm just saying, if anybody's just listening to the audio, they're like, <laughs> what is this did he just come, like, right, right now? Did he just. <laughs> he did not. Is that what it sounds like? Um, but. Brittany, do you can you is this what it Bro, sounds like? What do you think? Uh, but yeah, they would like do like stunts and shit, and like I don't know if they're still. Oh, a thing. they did stunts. But it, like, no, oh. they were riding down the freeway, standing on a motorcycle. I would consider that a stunt. I mean, yeah, but that's dangerous, Jonas. Uh, yes, I, one of them probably didn't die. Have you ever ridden a motorcycle? Uh, I have not. I've ridden on one twice. You've, you you were a bitch. I was um, under the age of 15. I mean. <laughs> so, yes, I rode bitch. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah, I'm just asking a question. I mean, How about a moped? You ever ridden one? No, I've never ridden a two. I've never driven a two wheeled item except for a manually pedaled bicycle. That was unnecessarily verbose, but all right. I, I respect it. Uh, I've ridden on a moped once and I feared for my life. I would. I don't want to ride an open thing. I like being encompassed. Yeah, I, I do agree. like, I mean, like a convertible is cool. Like a Jeep with the top off and shit is okay. But like, nah, dude, I'm not. No. When I lived with, uh, let's change the name. When I lived with Drew, uh -huh. he had a moped and he would ride it to work every day. And he even took it from like Erie, PA. To Ashtabula on Whoa, the freeway. You rode a moped on, on the freeway? A fucking moped. Dude, that's insanity. Yeah, and that's like a what? Like an hour? No, it's like a 50 minute ride on a car. So it's almost an hour. It took him like an hour and a half on the moped because he was going like the. But riding on the freeway is <laughs> dangerous, dude. Oh my God, we fucking did it. Good shit, Joey. Our kicker, I don't even know his name. He did it. The nameless. Ooh, Seals Jones gonna okay, eat. What are we gonna do? Oh, we're, we're gonna feed him fucking grits. We're just eating some poutine. <laughs> That's Canadian. Dude, I though. want poutine. There's a place here that has poutine. Shut your fucking mouth, Jonas. It has wings and poutine. What? The <laughs> you can go eat wings and poutine. I want some poutine. Poot some poutine. <laughs> <laughs> I want some God poutine. Damn. Jonas, stop. <laughs> <laughs> that was such a Jonas joke. I do want some poutine. I do too. I've never had it. I'm interested. It's freaking good, dude. It's like fucking they take fries and they put gravy gravy on it and it's got cheese curds and they melt. How could you? You can't really fuck that up. They have different kinds of poutine at this point. Yeah. I've had mushroom-like poutine before. I've never. Oh, my God. There was only one place in all of Florida I could find it. Really? Yeah. I don't know why this wing place has poutine. I don't know if it's like... What's the guy the who owns it is Canadian or something, or is this like a Canada? I've never, I've never even heard of it. I just found out that the uh, the bar right around the corner that we went to that one night, they yes. they have Impossible Burgers there. Oh, they have like vegan? Yeah, like the Impossible Burgers, like the name, the brand oh, Impossible son of Burger. A bitch. Oh, is that like, is that like the high end ones or something? Yeah, apparently those are the ones that are so close to tasting like real meat. Uh, they're actually supposed to be getting massively in market. I guess. Oh, and there. like that's why they're so popular because they you, they really taste like yeah, meat. Yeah. Oh. Huh. So I'm thinking about getting one of it's those. It's like it's like can't can't believe it's not beef. It's like that. Like yeah, yeah I guess. Okay. It's like the butter. I don't know, man. What is uh what is the difference between margarine and butter? Ooh, I know, sturgeon. I know you're a connoisseur. Uh, margarine is fake. Does it taste? It's not. It's, it, it tastes just like butter, kinda. 
Kinda. It's just, it's not nearly as fatty. It's made, I, I don't even know. They make it out of, like, oil instead of, like, cream, I think. Yeah, Isn't I that think, what it is? I think so. Uh, live studio audience, Martha Stewart, I'm calling, I'm calling on you. Um, what is it? What is the difference oh between? Oh, my God. <laughs> Well, You're what? Martha Stewart. Yeah, I forgot She's she was here. Too. You forgot she was like that excited. bitch owes me money. <laughs> wow. God damn it, Martha. <laughs> Bring your ass over. We'll here. ask her. We'll find. She's she's at the shop bar right now with Snoop Dogg. Margarine versus butter. Which one do you prefer? I, I mean, butter is good. It's just not nearly as good butter. for you. Yeah, Actual margarine butter. is. I mean, it's. But that comes from cow tits, though, man. I'm not cool with like anything that comes from a cow tit. You, you I'm just like keeping cheese. it a buck. You nah. like cheese, dude. Don't fucking say you don't like cheese. It's a lie. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> all, right, all right. I mean, you don't like milk. I know that, but che you like cheese. Yeah, but I feel like I'm allowed to, to place my uh, distaste for wherever you want. Exactly. So yeah, I fuck with cheese, but I don't fuck with milk. I don't fuck with butter. Yeah, dude. This is I don't really eat butter very much either, to be honest. Unless a recipe calls for it, I don't yeah. put butter on stuff unless it's toast. And I don't eat toast very often. So toast. When's the last time you had a good bagel? <laughs> dude, I don't even toast. The Let's bagels. get to the bagel data. Dude. Let's tell everybody about our bagel preferences. I like blueberry bagels with strawberry cream cheese uncooked. Ew. Dude, it's fucking bomb. I didn't know I'd like it, but I did. <laughs> you know what else is really good? Those cinnamon crusted bagels from Panera. Didn't know I'd like that either. One day I was at my fucking side gig and fucking they were like, here, bruh, here comes fucking bagels from Panera. And I'm like, what's a Panera? And they're like, it's not how you pronounce it, but here's a bagel anyway. And then they had, I was like, why is there crusty cinnamon on this? And they're like, that's how we do. And I'm like, what the fuck? And I ate it and I was like, heaven. That's basically a dessert. You, did, you ate a donut. <laughs> I believe that's a donut that you're talking about. Oh, is it? <laughs> uh, we're going to do another trick play. I don't believe you. You, you just described the donut, Jonas. Oh, my God. They, did, they let worked. us do it again. Twice we've done it in one game. Oh, oh he just that? dabbed. That's it. Jonas, one, you knew what it was. One single dab, <laughs> and he ran. Jonas, pat yourself on the back for going I, with a dab. My is. back is padded. The bonus points if you can tell me who originated the dab. It was a rapper. <laughs> dab Master Flex. <laughs> God damn it, Jonas. It was so close. <laughs> Uh, I, you know, and I honestly, I do know this, but I can't remember who the fuck it was. I've heard this before. Who, who, who popularized the dab? Cam Newton. Cam Newton. You got it, Jonas. You <laughs> fucking, no, dude, we're going with that. He, he used it in football. I'm rewriting the wiki page Fortnite. as we speak. Where's my phone? Who actually popular? Was it Drake? <laughs> uh... That's kind of close. We, we haven't made any Drake jokes, and we were in. Four, Are we four, supposed to? Four, dude, Toronto, man. Oh, shit. If you're eating it, it's too late. Yeah, dude. We got to get more life. Preference? We got to get more life into this team. What is your bagel preference? These are all Drake album titles, to be I know. It's all right. Um, I, you're, you're so far gone, oh, I wouldn't shit. expect you to know. Ooh, you know what? He almost went to Marvin's room. <laughs> All right, look at him trying to flex. Yeah, dude. Look at him trying I mean, to flex. You know, he has a scorpion tail. Oh, man, Jonas. Jesus, I don't know, but, you know, he's, he might be Sandra's Rose, but he might not be. <laughs> oh, God. I mean, you know, you never know. All right, Jonas. <laughs> Maybe he's from Portland. Bow. Jonas, that was, just, that, was just a, that was just a state. That was a song, dude. <laughs> by Drake. Portland. Jonas has really got the club going up on dude, a Tuesday over I, here. I am not. <laughs> he does. He just wants one dance, dude. That's it. <laughs> yeah, he just wants one dance. I know some Drake songs, dude. A little bit. A little bit. Anyways, your bagel friend. I don't fucking eat bagels. What do I look like? Some sort of Neanderthal? So, like, you had that whole thing have all bagels. Those. You don't even eat bagels? <laughs> oh, no, dude. You son of a bitch. There's way too many carbs in that. Are you fucking <laughs> Yeah, you're fucking, yeah, Mr. Fucking. What? You're going to talk about my peanut butter and pickles, bitch? <laughs> wow. Bring them up. I wasn't even going to bring it up. up. <laughs> I wasn't even going to bring that up, but I guess you brought it up. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I ate a peanut butter and pickle sandwich or two. Right before we ate? Yeah. We're not eating anything. We're playing it, but still. Yeah, and try it uh, at home. I mean, I, I did try it. Don't one shake one day, your dude. head. It, try. I, mean, I tried it, dude. Don't fucking diss me. I'm not talking to you. I was talking oh. to everybody at home. Oh, everyone judging. else. Yeah, the 
home studio audience. And I was talking to Brittany. Well, fucking uh, Martha Stewart shaking her head that she likes them. Yeah, see, and Martha Stewart knows her shit when it comes to the kitchen. Yeah, dude, of L- course. Listen, let's Barack. Barack, but tr- trust me. I know. I know he's not happy, but he's. I know oh I didn't God. vote for you. Oh Jesus! <laughs> but you don't have to use that against me. Just because he has the president card, I mean the Secret Service is waiting outside. I mean maybe you should go see the Secret Service, fucking peanut butter and pickle sandwiches. Yeah, make him some, Martha. Get on. Martha, it. get on it. Get on that shit. Just you vote every time. Never. <laughs> 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 we won't get into that. I think it's only important to pander for like going out and vote during voting times anyway. So. You're, gonna, you're gonna like do rock the vote, like blocky yeah, exactly. big face. Oh, he stood him. Wow, he threw him down like he's fucking yesterday's trash, folks. Talk about rock rocking the vote in January where it has no bearing on anything. Uh, there's no there's no midterm primaries coming on right now. They just happened in November. You know what, Jonas? I don't have... I know, but that was like two months, three months ago. Um, how many months are there between November and January? You know, Jonas, look. I'm curious. I don't know. I mean, I'm just asking. Are we here to have conversation or make each other look like a bunch of cocks? Which one do you want to do? <laughs> are we having conversations? Because I can dress you up like a cock if you want to. I can get some feathers. <laughs> A fucking goblet, and I can put that on your neck. We can do that. Cock goblet on me? That sounds kind of erotic. I don't think I'd like that. Cock goblet. (laughs) Jesus. That sounds awful. Just just full of them to the brim. Oh, gross. (laughs) Like a martini. All right, Jonas. Uh, Yeah, so you you do vote. Good for you. Everybody should. Grandma votes. Second down. <laughs> down this close what? To the goal line. First down, Nothing, man. What, dude? Why are you? Why are you? I'm not, dude. I don't know. I don't know if I've ever met Grams. No, you haven't, man. No. Nah. I've met your mom's. Yeah, she was here. Yeah, my mom is supposed to be coming up somewhere soon here. Oh, really? Yeah. That's sweet. I don't know when though. She'll show up one day. <laughs> like, oh, by the way, my mom's here. <laughs> like, oh, hey. She could. She went to, like, Israel and shit. Damn, dude. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck that was all about. Do you want to go to Israel? Not really. I was going to say, dude. I would like to go to... Um... <laughs> oh, oh, you ripped his face mask off! That's a fucking foul. If you could go anywhere in the world, Jonas, where would you want to go? One place. Name it. And don't say into my bedroom. That that does not count. I know. See? I know him. Um, You don't know. Iceland? Australia? What the fuck is... Those are two very different places. You're very different places. You got to give me a why. I don't have, I don't have like a don't, wish list, man. You don't have a wish list? You wouldn't know. So if I were like, hey, you want to go to Hawaii? I'd be like, sure, let's go. What about Japan? I'd go there. I'd go to China. I'd go to, I would like to see Saudi nah. Arabia, but I'd die. <laughs> yeah. I'd kill you for going. <laughs> Fair enough. I would, I would like to go to Japan. Japan be sweet. Yeah, but it's we like We would be far. very tall over everyone there. Wow. Well, I don't know about that, John. That's true. Isn't Yao Ming from there? No, it's China. Okay, well, I'm racist, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, that's pretty stereotypical <laughs> guess of you, I'm friend. just a big old racist. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I just like Japan because uh, I like the culture. I guess. Yeah, I think it would be neat to go there. Yeah. It would be very interesting. I would like to see how they react. Um, to no, and the reason I say we'd be me. taller than everyone is I had a friend. We will call him Smeverit. Keeman. Um, <laughs> You're terrible at this. <laughs> yeah. You don't have to fabricate the last name. No, <laughs> her first name. That's his only name. Smever was... Keeman. Oh, okay, uh, all right, I got you. <laughs> uh, he was there, and he's about the same height as I. And uh, he, he said he towered over everyone. Yeah. Like he could, like he, in the crowds of people, he could like see. Forever. Yeah, I would like to go there. I'd like to see how they react to seeing I'm like what six foot three, big yeah. black dude. 
<laughs> They'd probably be like, oh, you play. Oh, the surgeon picked you, it off. You play basketball? <laughs> They'd be like, what NBA team do you play for? Right. You just say, the Hawks. Yeah, keep a little lighter on the accent, you know, so we don't want to get. <laughs> Did I have an accent at all? <laughs> yeah, a little bit of one. I just want like a light accent. A light accent isn't offensive. A heavy accent, it's like it gets a little, a little iffy. A little, a little push in the cusp of the old yeah. racial trend. Yeah. Hey, man. <laughs> dude. <laughs> Give him an, like an Indian accent. No, dude, I'm not doing that. Oh, his mother said I was the man. And Whoa. Let's go. Let's go right for the moms. Well, dude, that's, everybody, I can't help everybody's moms calling Saquon up. It's going to get you fucked up one of these days. Everyone's mother is calling Saquon and asking for favors. All right. I'm the owner. I see the call log, bro. And when some dude My slaps office you. all day long. Hey, Saquon in. This is fucking Joey Johnson's mom. <laughs> when some dude slaps you in the street. <laughs> Out of the blue. <laughs> I want you to be like, yep, I deserve that. <laughs> it's fine. I definitely would say I deserved it. <laughs> Just some yep. random guy. Yep, I deserved it. I deserved to get slapped. <laughs> He's like, this is for talking bad about my mother on a Madden video on YouTube. <laughs> like, oh, shit. One day it's going to get to that point, John. So if we stick with it. Yeah, eventually. Dude. That day is actually the day you want. I the day it. where people get pissed off over something that you said in a YouTube video. Oh, God, so I can fucking have to, like, make an apology video? Like a fucking fuck? <laughs> I'm so sorry if I offended you for being a snowflake. Hey, man, if you want if you want what comes with the success, you want that. Oh, the surgeon, he's fucking picking out a kidney. Oh, he's flexing on me. Oh, look at he's humping this dude. He just humped the dude on, the dude on camera. <laughs> he, was, he was like, guess what? You need humped, I got your humping. <laughs> Football player humped on live on YouTube. <laughs> That's what we'll do. That's how we'll make <laughs> Not it. Not safe for work. <laughs> yeah. They're like, excuse me, sir. We have to flag your video. As Hell famous. yeah, dude. All right. Let's see who's going to fucking be the man. <laughs> I don't know. Let's see who's going to fucking be the man. Here it comes. The surgeon. Oh, my God. He just oh. fucking ruptured a kidney with his scalpel. I can't even believe that, man. He, he was lower. trying to, he was doing a, an what? aorta replacement, and he just tapped the old fucking subcockle and dropped it down into the, into the butter zone. <laughs> All of that, Jonas. <laughs> I mean, he couldn't help it, I would it, like dude. to see somebody draw a diagram <laughs> of whatever the fuck you just said there. Dude, he can't help it. He's just, he, all you can do is hope to contain him. I need to know what a butter zone looks like. Oh, exactly. it's, it's like Seals Jones. We're the right, winners. We're pretty close. Yeah, we have uh, our kicker has thrown as many touchdowns as our uh, as our quarterback. Jones, that that trick play seems to be uh, the butter zone. It seems to be transcending dimensions. Yeah, dude. You know, it's it's been a part of every Madden series, every dimension. Whoa. Oh, that was some bullshit. He ran around that guy blocking like he knew it was coming. Gatekeeping 101. Gatekeepers 101. 42 to 10. Yeah, dude. We're Jesus. They all can't be winners except Jonas, for us. Man, they're already dead. <laughs> they're already dead. I'm sorry, guys. You're already dead. They're already dead, man. Can we yeah. just can we just sim out the rest of the game? We only have 19 seconds. <laughs> so, yes, I guess we could. Slip <laughs> it out, man. Give him, just let him die. Oh, the surgeon. I folks. knew. See, this is what I was talking about, man. You knew you were just going to shoot him again. Dude, I love to make them suffer. I want them to ride a trail of tears all the way back. This is the problem. Where they came this from. is the problem with the police nowadays, you know. What? <laughs> that thing just won't let you die. Wow, dude. Trying to say the police do things? Uh, we're not gonna get into that. All right, that's on that <laughs> note. That's for sure. You know what, Jonas? Let's reflect about this episode before we end. It. I have no idea what we said, dude. I don't either. I don't know. We've said any of the episodes we talked about what ever. Is, what did we talk? <laughs> Martha Stewart and company. <laughs> Michelle. Michelle. What do we talk about? Michelle. And I'm talking about the. Uh, She's doing beer bongs. The she one from Full House. Talk right now. All right, everybody. Michelle that is Olsen. all the time that we have for today's episode. 
please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. While you're at it, lie to your buddies. Tell them we're worth watching. Tell them we're a little funny. We're not. And, uh, mm -mm. no. Mm -mm. But for Jonas, for TNT Dynamite, yep. we are out. Next game, guess what? Charles and I will be.